Back and do, I'm back at it again with another episode of, or actually, no, not another episode, the last two episodes of Halo. And I'm here with... Podbox <laughs> Stream from Beyond the Airwaves, leveling up. What's up? Yep, so we're going to be watching the last two episodes on Paramount+. Plus. We'll give mm-hmm. our um, series review and our reviews about these last two episodes. Because, mm-hmm. you know, it's been all right. Not great. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, and and the thing is, you know, we do apologize for taking so long and doing this whole thing, but we've been busy. Life. We've got a yeah. life. Yeah. Hey. Hey, can you call Alejandro for me? I don't have his phone number. Ole Alejandro, Batman. Okay, all right. <laughs> Bye. Sorry. I was saying, Holy Alejandro, Batman. <laughs> yeah. Alejandro, the cool guy, he works at um one of the um, local golf places here. Cool. He got screwed over by the same principal I did back in high school, so. Hold on a second. Oh. Uh, I'm going to get something to drink. Okay, I'm going to close the garage. I'll be back in a second. So, you're going to see empty space for about 30 seconds. Okay, sorry about that, folks. But when yep. it's seven o'clock, I gotta close the garage because uh, if you keep that cl- that garage closed during the day, uh, in the summer, in the heat and humidity, you're getting. Can you say overheated garage? <laughs> oh yeah, for a hundred percent. Like I have to, like my dad likes to keep the heat up in the summer because you know it destroys my power bill. Well, Man. let's put it this way: my, I keep we keep ours at seventy-seven because for us, it's comfortable. Uh huh. Yeah, it's just when there's only two people in the house, just mom and me, so. Same here. I only have my dad and myself, so. Mm-hmm. But yeah, anyway, like y'all want to get right into it? Let's do this. Number eight. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Uh, sorry for some reason. Ads. Yep. I already gotten past the ads leading mm. into it, so. I wish Adblocker made a way to trick the website into not thinking there's a. Yeah, but I think a lot of these websites are starting to figure Adblocker out now, so. Yeah, and like being able to code and keep up with it, you know what I mean? That's a bad thing. Mm-hmm. You want to skip the. um. <clears throat> Recap and intro? Yeah. yeah. Okay, well I'm I'm ready to start the episode. Just let me know okay. when you're ready. Uh, okay, I'm ready. Okay. I'm at one oh, yeah, second. Be- one second, okay. Mm-hmm. Three, two, one, go. I wouldn't mind seeing this guy play Punisher, to be honest with you. Yeah, he'd yeah. make a pretty good Punisher, I would think. He looks exactly like John Burnsaw, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. And if John Burnsaw doesn't want to do like doesn't want to do Punisher without the rated arm rating, maybe mm-hmm. they could bring this guy in to play the PG thirteen version. You know what I mean? Cause I would love to see a rated R Punisher again, but I think he was I don't know, I think he really I don't know if they'll allow him to do it, which kind of sucks. You know what I mean?
Just like, what the what? <laughs> yeah, they hit the Halo, though. But mm -hmm. Halo usually has, like, multiple bases on it, like, from the foreigners. Mm-hmm. You want to skip it? Yeah, let's skip. Okay. Are you at 353 or? 355 now. Okay, same here. Planet Reach. Reach, Reach actually City. gets destroyed. Yep. Reach City, USA. No. <laughs> mm -hmm. Reach City actually gets destroyed in a video game called Halo Reach. Ah. And, like, basically, the last hero on the planet before it got um, glass is um, somebody by the name of Rookie Six, I think, or something like that, or Six. Mm -hmm. Pretty cool. The last mission is pretty... It's pretty um, it's pretty sad, but, you know, it's like a last stand, basically. You're basically like Vader destroying the rebels. Uh-oh. Somebody's got his eye on him. Mm-hmm.
I don't know why, but that woman looks like Kamala Khan's mom from Ms. Marvel. Oh my god. I think it is. Yeah. I think it is. Holy yeah. shit. No wonder she looked familiar. Holy yeah. shit. I think it is her. Mm -hmm. Let me check and make sure. Yeah. But I'm, now that you mentioned it, I think that is her. Yeah, because it, it would make a lot of sense because they sound the same. Literally that woman looks like pa she's Pakistani, just like the actual mm -hmm. like Kamala herself. So, television. No, she's not in the movie. Oh, oh, she's not in the show. Nope. Okay. Dang. Damn, I thought it was her. I thought so too, but to see him not in that suit every second, you know? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Damn. I think they made modifications to her. Probably. They're glassing them. That's what they're calling it. Glassing. Mm. <laughs> gotcha. Yeah. Yep, glassed. See? From the Halo game. Got it. Kind of scary, though, you know, getting glassed. You're yeah. literally turning into, like, literally minerals, basically. Mm. It's 
I kind of do hope they do a massive time jump and then have the Arbiter helping out. Mm-hmm. Selvatum is what they call them. And we're commercial. Yep, commercial. Commercial. For the next 85 seconds for me. Same here. Oh, dang, that was quick. Yep. They're reverse engineering the ships. Mm hmm. <laughs> I think that answers the question. No. <laughs> Damn. I think. <laughs> Audio test. <laughs> yeah. 
He's going to say, you the human. He's going to break her out, isn't he? Okay, that's what an earth expects. <laughs> yeah. How old is she? I have no idea. Yeah. And here's the sex scene that everybody was talking about. Oh, okay. Damn, Cortana just watching. Hmm. For shame, hmm. Cortana. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, mm -hmm. what? <clears throat> I'm sorry, like, but, yay! Sorry, sorry. It's like Cortana is ruining the scene here. <laughs> yeah. Ha <laughs> ha. 
He's still there. I would have thought he was gone. <laughs> Usually that's the rule of thumb. Usually someone wakes up and the other person's gone. <laughs> yep. Super awkward, you know what I mean? Yeah. I get the feeling she's about to do something really stupid. I think she is. You. Yeah. Yeah. Seriously, I I I lost a toenail to an accident. But it's like. Ew. Ew. Okay. Okay. Gross. Like, please put a bandage on it or something. Yeah, that's just a little bit too gross. But then again, it is a Showtime production, so yes. kind of expected. Oh! Yeah, you might better watch that off. <laughs> Tell you there's a band they didn't get me enough for that. <laughs> and we break 110 seconds. Nope. Honestly, why can't they make a sleep number bed for a single person instead of instead of a double side? It's like, come mm -hmm. on. <laughs> wait, who is that? Kind of can't wait to see more of hey, Obi Wan, you know what I mean? Yeah, mm hmm.
Oh, good night. Yep. Reach is gonna get destroyed and she's gonna die in it. Hmm. I'm calling that now. <clears throat> You're probably right. Hmm. Damn. Well, my niece is not here, so I can honestly say that woman's a cold hearted bitch. Yep. She's going to find a way to get out of that. Mm -hmm. Just wait. I love the casual outfit, though. That's nice. Yeah. <laughs> the house slippers and everything. Mm hmm. Or Tana's like, I don't like this. Yep. No, she didn't. Yep.
Damn. She's good. She's a good manipulator. Mm. Uh uh. Ooh, and she figured it out by herself. Oh, I think Halsey's becoming evil. Mm-hmm. Oh, boy. Uh-oh. Damn. He'll finish the fight. Oh. Or like, I ain't doing it. Mm hmm. They're going to kill her. Yep. Yep. Hmm. 
Damn. Oh, ho, ho, ho. she does. Damn. Oh boy. Mm -hmm. Advertise. Yep. Mm -hmm. On with the shoe. Mm -hmm. Uh oh, I think Miranda's got something figured uh -huh. out. Uh -huh. Oh, great. They got her tied up. Hmm. Hmm. Uh oh, she's going to try to connect with that. Uh oh, she's a fan of that girl is trouble.
Huh. It's Jason Bourne. Uh -huh. huh. Well, sort of. <laughs> yeah. Oh, she's get like, I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. Oh boy. Keep gone. Also, after this, I'm probably going to watch either One Punch Man or um, Jessica Jones Season 3. Okay. I heard rumors that we might be seeing her in the new She-Hulk series, so... Oh, good night. Behind you. Behind you. Behind you. Told him. <sighs> That's one way to get it done. Yep. Improvise. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh, she's oh. gonna die. Mm -hmm. It reminds me of some um, Civil War. Oh. <laughs> oh, thanks, Cortana. Yep. Boom. Forgot there's five people in this bunch. Ooh. Woo! 
Damn, he's literally beating him up like Captain America did Iron Man. Oh. Hi to the rescue. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. He's going to die, I have a feeling. That's usually what happens to these type people in these types of Damn. Woo! It's like, well, he's dead. Halo. Yep, he's dead. I told you it was going to happen. He's going to get to turn into a chicken tender. And I think that's it. Let's see. Oh, I hate it when they do that. Mm. I love how they come up with the crazy names of these, like, prescription medications and all. And they say, hey, we got side effects we got to tell you about, too. But then again, I think it is required by law anyway. Yeah. Are you on advertisement? Yeah. Oh, okay. Did you like this episode? Yeah, it was pretty decent. I, I, I like how at the end everything started, like, picking back up. I'm not, I was not... I am not a fan of the um the drama part of it, you know what I mean? Yeah. It needs to be pretty violent, you know? Yeah, I mean, it's what it's supposed to be. I mean, A, it's based off a video game. B, it is a Showtime production, so True, it's pretty much but... going, it's supposed to be violent. There's some duty involved. I mean, that's a given. It should be there. Video game, but the thing is, the video game itself doesn't really have a lot of drama, but, like, mm -hmm. it goes into the lore of the um, Covenant as well as the Forerunners and stuff. Uh, because, basically, Halsey and, like, Captain Keith and stuff, mm -hmm. they end up dying because of, well, Keith died of the flood, and that's mm -hmm. what prevents, that's what happened, 
Like that's why the Halo exists because of the flood. So. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa! Stop! Stop! Yeah. Stop! Stop! I, I didn't want to play yet. Oops. Dang! It's already got me to the second episode. Yep. So you want to talk a little bit about this episode? Sure. Okay. I paused it. Okay. There we yeah. go. Yeah. So. I do like how they're fighting him. It kind of reminds me of the um, Halo 5 Guardians um, storyline a little bit. Uh -huh. Because basically in Halo 5 Guardians, um, Chief actually becomes um, misguided because Cortana actually went evil. Uh. Cortana herself and not Marine um, Keys. Yeah. So therefore, she's trying to save um, Keith. Like, she tried to save um, like uh, something like that. I, I yeah. Hey, the, hang the, on just a second. Let me get this. Let me get my charger in here. Okay, there we go. Okay, go ahead. But like, basically, she ends up kind of like I'm um, getting hurt and stuff. Like um, stuff, and like she goes rampant, which is basically a form of the end of the life for an AI. They basically go senile, or mm -hmm. how you describe it. And Cortana basically um, turns chief against the people. But then they realize. Then he realizes that. She's not completely there. She's been hijacked basically by the um the um pre the, um the forerunners or the um the ones before I forgot what they're called. The um the mm. not the covenant, uh they're forerunners and then there's the um precursors. And like basically I think she's trying to bring back the precursors or give the precursor information to the humans or something like that. I don't know for sure. But for some reason, they they kind of like they killed Cortana off in Halo Six, but it's not mm -hmm. explained how. It's not really explained. But we do get a new, like a new Cortana, basically, or a new version of her that's like still the same, you know, and still, but it's like completely new. Doesn't have any memories of Cortana, you know. It's kind of mm -hmm. weird, you know. So, but yeah, overall, it's, it she was all right in this movie, like um, but. Yeah, like I don't know. I I I, I will admit, like so this the show should have been at least six episodes. I think it just ran a little bit too long for a ser the story they wanted to tell, and I think they should have also just left um left the um oh, what's her name the girl from last episode the Asian girl what's her name uh what the the which one the Quan, I think, or something like that, or uh, in the in Miss Marvel, or no, 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 and the um, in, oh, Quan, um, uh, yeah, it was Quan, it was Quan, yeah, like Quan. I think they should have not have her in because I feel like that kind of delayed a little bit um some of the stories you what they wanted to tell, you know. Mm -hmm. So yeah, maybe next time they'll do something better, you know. But I I, I don't know. I just feel like. They should have focused a lot more on Chief and developing his story as well as like the um, the Halo ring itself. You know what I mean? I think they were missing a lot of stuff here. So yeah. So maybe I mean, like I said, from 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 the perspective of someone who has never played Halo, I'm finding it interesting. I mean, it's not overly exciting. Yeah. But I'm finding it interesting enough. It's like, hmm, you know, just watch a little bit. You know, see what I think. You know, because. Because, like I said, I've never played it, so I have no clue, really. For sure. And but, I totally understand. Like, yeah. a lot of these stories sometimes don't even get explained, you know? And, like, mm -hmm. like I'll admit, the last three games have been, uh, like, either mediocre or kind of bad. Yeah. Like, um, for example, Halo 5 was really bad, just very incomprehensible story and yeah. a oh, lot yeah. less. Oh, yeah. I've had that happen before. That's better. Sorry, I had a bit of hair sticking up. I was like, that's embarrassing. <laughs> mm -hmm. But yeah, overall, I don't know. So, I'd probably give this episode probably an 8 out of 10. I'm going to go a little lower, actually, with about 7.5. Okay, understandable. Yeah, yeah 8.10, only because of the end, it kind of reminded me of some of the Marvel fight scenes, you know. So mm -hmm. Anyway, you want to get into the last episode? Yep, I'm only one second in, so... <laughs> okay, I need to, like, get the Paramount stuff over with, you yeah. know? Yeah. Da, 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 something like that. <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of excited. I'm, like, really, like, hyped. Oh, okay. You ready? Right. Yeah. Three, 
two, one, play. Um, and then G ends up paying for. <laughs> Gonna make a bold prediction. I say Reed City gets destroyed right here, but before the end of this episode. Yeah, I'm calling it now to come in and actually raid it, and we'll actually see like the um the actual video game thing, you know. Mm-hmm. If you're willing, I can give you a few of the walkthroughs and stuff that I used to watch when I was younger, and some of the stuff I still watch now. Okay. Well, I may I may look at it eventually. Yeah, like it's, there's a guy named MLK Ice and Fire who does all the video games and stuff, mm, cool. and he like he's done Halo multiple times, and it's really fun. He never died in it, so you put, and he also plays on Legendary, so you see all the dialogue and stuff. So. Ah. I do think we're going to get a Halo 3 and remastered eventually. Mm-hmm. Because it's been almost, shit, since 2007, I think, or something like that. So, I think we're due for a new one. Uh-oh. Damn. Uh oh. Oh boy. If he died right here, he doesn't die like in the. Mm hmm. Uh 
Uh oh. Uh oh, she's gonna kill Halsey. Uh -oh. I'm shocked the woman didn't die, though. You know what I mean? Yeah. Damn, she's running fast. And it's like, when adrenaline's flowing. Yep. <clears throat> Damn. dead yep he's out yep run Halsey run run Halsey run <laughs> sorry couldn't resist that one ah she got a skate pod Mm. Mm. Ouch. Mm. Good night. Mm. Mm. I think she's about to go down with the ship. Yep. She's gonna sacrifice herself. Ain't no way she's gonna survive that. Yeah. Well, they're Spartans. So okay, kind of maybe she did. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of hard to kill Spartans in this, like, even ah. then, you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> yes. Oh man. Ooh. Okay. Okay. We're just right. now I'm getting to the intro. Come on. Okay. All right. <laughs> I skipped it. I know. Uh. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay, let me talk to Brandon, okay? No. Okay. Okay. Bye bye. Sorry. Did you skip the intro now? Yeah, I did. Oh, dang it. Okay. Okay, hold on. I'll pause. I'm at 1235. Okay. Let me know when I'll you get there. I'll just get over there. Yeah. Let me know when you're ready. Three, two, one, play. Thought he named his team Black Team or something in the earlier in the episode. That's kind of weird. Hmm. Or Blue Team. I forgot what it's called. It's just weird. Hmm. I think it's been silver the whole time, but we'll double check. There's a fight. The day we finish the fight.
And there goes Halsey on the run. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. And time for a commercial. Yep. And back to the show. Oh. Um, and she's recaptured. Back. I'm back. Okay. Ex-husband and the daughter. Yep. Uh, I gotta pause. I'll be right back. Oh, okay. 754. Okay, now I'm back. Mm -hmm. Shall I pick it up? Uh, yeah. What um time are you on? Seventeen fifty-eight. Okay. Um, yeah. All right. Three, two, one, go. Go. Did the prophets? Mm -hmm. Truth, mercy, and um, regret. Mm-hmm.
the great journey. Mercy is not going to show mercy. Mm -hmm. She's going to die. Knowing the mercy, prophet of mercy, yeah. He's going to die. Damn. Spaghettified? Yep. <laughs> Damn. If we if they lost them um, artificial gravity, then why aren't they floating? Good question. Uh-uh. 
They made it. Yep. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, it's after another commercial. Mm -hmm. Only collagen Batman. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Back to the show. Yep. Two. Yep. And Halsey with a bleeding lip. Yep. It's like, that's the biggest mess I've been in. Yeah, she'll get interrogated by her own daughter. Mm -hmm. Damn, keep being a fucking smirk. Guilty.
commercial again. Yep. Time to finish the fight. Whee! If this thing were like 3D, I'd be sick. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh. Oh, Grant! Grant! You like the video game now. Yeah. Grunts are actually smaller than the um, actual. Damn. Oh, shit. Uh oh. It's a clone. I think that might be the clone from the actual um, first episode of Cortana, remember? Yeah. So. There's the elites.
Uh -oh. Oh boy. Damn, that's scary. Oh, looks like they know how to drop just as much as the Silver Team does. <laughs> oh shit. Hell yeah, the Hunters. Hell yeah. And the Gravity Hammer, my favorite weapon of Halo. My Ooh. favorite fucking weapon. I love it. It's so OP. <laughs> Tartarus. Okay, now they're using CGI, like video game CGI now. Uh-huh. There we go, the first first point of view. Yeah. Hey! Hey! Like the video game! Woo! There we go. Hell yeah! Woo! Oh shit! That's a reference to the um the Reach game because basically um in Reach the um the guy dies at the end and they literally mm -hmm. get compounded by all these guys. Hell yeah! It's like Bungie made a few clip scene for the show, you know? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Damn. Damn. Uh -huh. Oh, shit. She's activating the halo. And just blew everybody off. Yep. Uh... Please tell me they're gonna say there's seven or eight rings. Uh-oh. He's gonna say it's time to finish the fight. Oh, uh, he did. It's time for a last stand.
You did. Yep. Uh-oh, he's gonna kill her. He's dead. Tartarus. Finish the fight. He better say finish the fight. He better say finish the fight. Oh, come on. Damn. <clears throat> oh. Uh oh. She took over and over. Mm hmm. Ooh. Uh oh. Oh boy, Cortana's kicking it in the high gear. Yeah. Now it looks like the game. Woo! The Pelican! The video game music! I know this! They play it at the end of every single Halo game. Huh. It's the ending theme, basically. Dude, Halo's music is amazing! Genuinely!
He did. Damn. Ouch. Damn, they're going to cauterize her stuff. Yep. Damn. They're literally cauterizing her room. Mm -hmm. There's the real Dr. Halsey. Mm-hmm. Damn, she escaped. Yep. He is. Oh, shit. So that guy escaped, basically, or was mm. that a clone? Hmm. I don't really feel anything because we barely knew this Riz character, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, if it was her who died, then yeah, I feel something, but... Mm -hmm. That's the end. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. We're doing an after credit scene. I have no idea, and I can't tell right now because I'm stuck in commercials. Yeah, same. You want to talk a little bit about it now? Yeah. Got 70 seconds, though. <laughs> yeah. Uh, just a little bit. I don't really feel for the series, you know what I mean? It kind of mm -hmm. just gradually kind of just went like this, you know? Mm -hmm. I Overall, I probably, like, there is a lot of issues with the series. Not e like not even including that it's, like, not canon or anything. 
is that a lot of these characters and stuff, I feel nothing for them, you know? Yeah. It's like, they're not really well written, you know? And there's a lot of um, stuff that's missing, you know? Halo's mm -hmm. supposed to be fighting aliens and basically trying to activate the Halo array. Yeah. And that's pretty much it. That's the whole story, just putting it blunt, like, with that little to no thing, but... So, I don't know. Like, I didn't feel for anything for these some of these characters, you know? Like, Key yeah. being a bad guy isn't really something I'm a fan of, because in, in, in the video game series, she's more of an anti-hero, you know? Like, mm -hmm. she goes against whatever other people say. It's mostly the anyone I see, you know? And she does actually get in trouble with it, but... And I do think we would have worked better with Selvatum, you know, being in the series with the Arbiter. Mm hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I just feel like this. They kind of missed the mark with this series. Yeah, I kind of felt like a letdown the finale a little bit. Yeah, like, I don't know. They're just. They should have shortened this series like by like three or four episodes. I think it would have worked in the five episode series, maybe around one to two hours each, yeah. you know, instead of forty five minutes, and maybe just change the way, like have it be more Master Chief fighting, like the um mm -hmm. the actual Covenant and and finding the Halo array and stuff, than actually like dealing with the human side of it, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it does not look like there's going to be any type of after scene in this one at all. Yeah. And I, did, I don't know. I just feel like this should have been done way better. Yeah, I agree. I, I, like, let's talk about each character. Um, John Master Chief, of course. Mm -hmm. I thought he was okay. He wasn't yeah. great. He was okay. But I do. I think the actor could play a really good Punisher, though, in Marvel. Mm -hmm. So maybe they'll do something with him there, and then um, then we got um like what's uh Riz or whatever um she or what well, not Riz but I the other um Spartans I didn't really feel for anything you know and I kind of feel like the one with the red haired chick I forgot her name I mm. think she was kind of like shoehorned in the last two or three episodes I would have liked to see her explore her humanity way more you know and then yeah. draw, make a more stronger bond with Chief. You know what I mean? I think they would have mm -hmm. been way, way better, you know, and maybe have her be connected to it. Yeah. And then, uh, how about what do you think? Um, well, I feel like in some aspects they really did miss the mark, because I feel like the finale was more like a letdown, because it didn't really it do didn't, as much as I hoped it would. Yeah. I don't know, it just feels like something's, like, not there. It's like something was taken out or something. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Yeah. Like, there's most likely an extended cut out there that explains some of the stuff that happens, you know? And I feel like the Covenant kind of got shoehorned to the side, and I'm, I'm not a big fan of that, because that's technically who Master Chief fights in the game, that's right. the last one, because he was fighting the, the foreigners. Mm -hmm. But other than... <coughs> But other than that, it just feels like something's, like, not there. And I really, like, if they were to do a season two, they got to, like, basically. They're going like, to have to really do some improving. Yeah, like, they, and, like, they got to get rid of the quant or they can't be having these side characters or something, you know. They can't, they just can't. You just can't do that. That's yeah. not what um Halo's about. It's a, Halo is about Master Chief and Cortana. Yeah. And, you know, and the UNSC are background characters, and that's all they were, background characters that helped further the plot. Yeah. Covenant was also the most important thing, and if they want to continue doing this, they got to introduce the Flood soon, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Huh? the right. Flood. Yeah, all I, I, overall, I'm going to give this series probably about maybe, I'm going to give it a 6.7 out of 10. Uh, six for me. It's a solid six. I just, I don't, it just kept on gradually getting, like, just missing marks and stuff, you know? Mm -hmm. Like, 
I did enjoy the first person thing they did at the end of this episode and some of the video game graphics, but I do think they should have just like done it like they did in the other movies. Cause there's a few other Halo movies that are done way better than this, like um, mm-hmm. Flashpoint, not Flashpoint, um, something, something Point, and there was another one called, I think Halo Reach or something, and it features one of the women from um, 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 Narnia. She it features her in the series. Okay. And like basically, Master Chief shows up, and he's like basically kicking ass and chewing bubble gum, you know. Mm-hmm. And it's actually like, and he's like much like the character, you know. So yeah. And we don't see his face, which I think is very important when it comes to Master Chief. We never see his face because that's mm-hmm. the mysterious of him, you know. Yeah. What I mean? Yeah, but so, seriously, there, there's gonna be a season two, but they're gonna have to make some improvements. Yeah, and I feel like a lot they gotta like re. They're going to have to rewrite some of these characters to make them more, instead of, <coughs> make them less assholey. Because yeah. most of these mother- people were fucking assholes. And in the vi- video game, the only asshole really there was was Johnson. And that's because he's a motherfucker with a smart ass general, but he knew what he was doing. You know what I mean? Yeah. Mm-hmm. And I think they should introduce Johnson. Because Johnson, I feel like, would be a badass motherfucker in this series. Because Johnson... He literally took on the monitor uh, at um on one of the, in Halo Three and literally died killing her basically. Yeah, but it was so cool. And you're like, get the fuck out of here. Yeah, well, I don't know about you. Kids. Yeah, I don't know about you, but I am starting to get a little tired. Mhm. And like, I don't know. I just, I, I, and I'm, and I gotta mention, I'm not a big fan of the gir- human girl for a part of the Covenant thing. I just felt like that kind of was like not needed. I would have preferred somebody like a um. I would have preferred they had like an elite or something, you know what I mean? Like the people, the ones that you saw fighting, you know, like mm-hmm. a Master Chief. I think we would have seen the Arbiter do it, you know what I mean? So bad. Yeah. Or one of its um, brothers or something. I would have preferred to see that, you know, because that, that storyline is really good. Cell Vadim and Halo, like Master Chief, are literally like <coughs> two peas in a pod, basically. They work together and they fight together, you know? Mm-hmm. So. Yeah. I think it's a good point to wrap up for tonight. Yeah, for sure. All right, guys. Thank you for watching this. I'm Dragon Zero, and this is... Oddball Extreme from Beyond the Airways leveling up. Uh, we'll probably see y'all Wednesday when we watch both Obi-Wan and... Um, Miss Marvel. Miss Marvel, yeah. So, yeah. Thank y'all for watching our yep. re- last two episodes of Halo. We pro- I don't know if you want to, like, whenever I hit season two of Halo comes out, I don't know if you want to do that series or... Yeah, we'll, we'll just wait and see first. Yeah, How about, I'll probably watch it by myself without doing a reaction, and then if I like it, then uh, we can watch together or something, you know? Okay. Oh, sorry. Well, oh. yeah, if, Halo, if any of the Halo um, people see this, just know that's how you need to improve your story. You need to, like... Make more people likable instead of Master Chief or whatever, you know? Because that's the story about Halo. A lot of these characters are likable because they actually have a sense of duty and they're pretty fun, you know? Mm-hmm. But when you literally just shoehorn these people and make them fucking assholes, you know, you're just screwing up the thing, so. Yeah, all right. All right, guys. Thank y'all for watching, and peace. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> all right, uh... <laughs>